what's the funniest, and by that I mean sort of absurd, note you've gotten in the last year? We have sort of a special relationship with our standards and practices um, department, so that's always like really entertaining to me, just sort of, we were in a gynecologist's office and like the emails back and forth were like really outstanding. I have a couple framed in my office there, like, <laughs> like, and, and, like anatomy and like, like arrows and, and, but it's all, my other, recently there was like a, where we used like a, a song from Sublime called Caress Me Down and she like typed word for word this like really disgusting <laughs> lyric, but it's like so official, like it's on, you know, Fox email kind of thing and really <laughs> made me laugh. I guess it's, it's kind of a cop out answer to the question. <laughs> we started an arc where Charlie and his therapist slash girlfriend are doing a sex study a la Kinsey or Masters and Johnson. And so they have a room where they observe through a two-way mirror people having sex who are hooked to electrodes. And, um, and the note was, can you not have the sexual people being studied move up and down? So I thought if they move horizontally, it's not considered a sexual act. <laughs> but if they could not move up and down, that would be good. That was a pretty absurd note to get. <laughs> A lot of like rhythmic, like, you know, like it can't, like if the bed's gonna move, it can't be rhythmic. Can so be, then can, we're like be, on awkward. set and we're like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, it's like, I, I think uh, last year, it might have been last season, we had uh, Amy was doing a uh, nicotine addiction study and we had a monkey that was smoking and there was a joke. Uh, Sheldon asked, What have you learned so far in the study? It was so far, the monk, that monkey looks so much cooler than all the other monkeys. And we were told you can't say that smoking makes you look cooler, <laughs> even though it was about a monkey. So Chuck told uh, the network that he will personally respond to all the letters uh, from monkeys that get addicted to smoking because of our show. <laughs> so that was a note you rejected, essentially. Uh, I, there's more to the story. I can't even remember. I think then that joke stayed in, and then it was followed up with a, a monkey masturbating joke on top of it. Okay. Sort of with it. Do you have any other notes that you'd like us to address? <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes just pile in extra stuff, and then they mm -hmm. then they they finally just they get you know, too confused. You give them a few you didn't want anyways, and then they just that was the Saturday Night Live move that we used to pull. Is if you wanted to say a certain word that was like borderline, you would just load up the rest of the sketch <laughs> with like stuff that was absolutely not okay. I I can remember trading. I say okay, we'll trade you three dams and an ass yeah. for uh, yeah. I mean, it was like we did that a lot for at, at FX when I had a show at FX. That was a big. Move. The horse trading, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm shocked that they didn't catch on to... to well, I, I think they did. I don't think they weren't, they weren't stupid. I think they knew what was going on, but also they were sort of, what can you do? Like, if we say, like, look, we took 11 F-bombs out of that sketch, what do you want us to do? They're like, all right, fine. Just At a certain point, you just wear them down. You know what's funny is that, like, you said F-bomb instead of... Because I don't know if I'm allowed to curse. Right. I mean, we all know what he's saying, right? <laughs> but uh, <clears throat> but the, uh, the networks would have a problem with the character saying the words F-bomb yeah. now. Yeah, or effing. Yeah, or, or bleeping. Like, we would bleep things, and then they go, come on, guys, don't stop bleeping. We, but, but the bleeping's good, right? You, you're supposed to like the bleeping, because it means that they didn't swear. We found a creative way around that. We, we, we have a, the character who wanted, we wanted her to say, what the F is going on here? And they had a problem with that. So the line that we gave her was like, what the mother effing, seeing, essing, king, geeing, elling F is going on here? And then our response was like, it's, she's, she's insane. She's not like, those aren't, those aren't swear words. She's just a crazy person. And they let us do it. Yeah. <laughs> We had a, a dyslexic guy or whatever said like the other mucking fuck. It was like it was it, it was like the guy said it all, but uh, not in the right way. But the audience exactly knew what they were saying. <laughs>